Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toledo located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2012 Toyota Venza. Now the most notable features on this Venza is its power moonroof, its power liftgate, as well as its heated front seats. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2012 Toyota Venza. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this Venza is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lamps and then if we take a look just down below on the grill you're gonna see your block heater. Over on the side you have your 20 inch aluminum alloy wheels. Now you also have your body side mullings so the nice thing with the body side mullings is if you're in a tight parking lot and somebody accidentally hits their door against yours rather than hitting your door it's gonna hit the body side molding instead. Now you also have your heated mirrors, your foldable mirrors, and the other nice thing with this Venza is it does have the smart key system with it. So with the smart key system you can lock all the doors simultaneously just by pushing on the two little lines you see there on the handle. Push on it once, it'll lock all the doors automatically for you, and then if you put your hand between the handle, it'll unlock the front door for you as well. Now this is all possible just as long as you do keep the key fob on you at all times. And the color we're going to be taking a look at today is Blizzard Pearl. Now to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats, just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you have your light gray leather interior seat surfaces with your power driver's seat with lumbar support. Taking a look just over on your left hand side, you have your mirror controls along with your power lift gate release, traction control on and off, and then you also have a little bit of storage space for some coin. On the inside of your driver's side door, you have your window locks, power locks, window controls, both your front and rear windows. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your uh, volume control, scroll function, mode select, as well as your Bluetooth, voice recognition, and cruise control. Now you also have that push button start, so all you have to do is put your foot on the brake, hit the push button, and it will start up for you automatically. Now I'm just going to close in on the exact kilometers, just so you can see what it's currently sitting at. And taking a look at the very top there, you're going to see that you have your... Um, digital clock as well as your exterior temperature gauge and then you also have your temperature controls with your distance to empty up there as well. Now taking a look right here you're gonna see your temperature control settings with uh, or sorry your AM or sorry folks your touch panel display and then you also have your hazard lights and then your info and select and your set setup just located at the very top here so when you actually hit the setup it's just gonna uh, pull up just at the very top there. Now you have your navigation system and then if we head into the setup menu you're going to see your general clock, voice, navigation as well as a couple of other additional features. Now you also have that premium JBL sound system, temperature control settings just located down below with your dual zone climate control, heated seat controls, mounted to an automatic transmission, and then if you'd like you can place your phone here and then while it's uh, sitting there you can actually have it charging just by uh, connecting the cord just through the bottom here. And then taking a look at the very top, you have your auto dimming rear view mirror with your digital compass and a couple of the controls you'll see at the top is your integrated garage door opener, open and close and tilt up and down feature for your power moonroof just in case you do want to have a bit of a breeze while you're driving. And then you'll also have your sunglass case holder. Now you also have an additional moonroof just in the back there for your rear passengers just in case uh, they want to enjoy the view just while you're driving too. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate. Now located on the back of your tailgate, you're going to find your backup camera just on your left-hand side. Rear hatch at least be located just over on your far uh, right-hand side. Now I'm just going to close in on the rear cargo space just so you have a much better idea of how much room there is. Now the nice thing is you do have that cargo, uh, um, cargo liner, I should say, in the back, so the nice thing with that is if you have any liquids placed on the back here and then something accidentally spills out then it's e much easier to clean up. The other thing is you can actually remove it and have it uh, cleaned up properly. You also have the tonneau cover in the back here so if you want to make sure your valuables are actually covered up just while you're going from store to store you can do so. You also have a power outlet just located on your right hand side. And then the other nice thing I like with this Venza is that you can actually uh, fold down that 60-40 split seats pretty fast just by pulling on the two handles that you see on either side there just in case you do need the additional space. Now the other thing I like is that you do have that power lift gate because a lot of times when you have your hands full with groceries or kids sports bags it's hard to actually close up the tailgate but all you have to do is just push on the button once and it will close automatically for you. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions on this 2012 Toyota Venza, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. 
The phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.